All right, nice shirt, Ryan. <laughs> um, so we've got uh, Marsden's pretty cool VF2 red line here, haven't yeah. we? And uh, what have we done to it? We, it used to be a stage seven. Yep. Year intake, headers, exhaust. Yeah, cam package. Yeah, cam package. Yep. And then he went, got a, a stage nine, which is just a Whipple. Just a Whipple. Yeah, just a Whipple. So, yep, we added the Whipple uh, to the Stage 7, which does make it a Stage 9. Yep. And uh, made some pretty good power. We're only running one boost pulley down from stock, because he's only actually running on 95 fuel. Yeah. So to make the most out of these, um, we like to run them on 98, so you can run a bit more timing in them. Yeah. Uh, but he's up north and there's only 95, so... Um, yeah, we, we always work with, with what, whatever we got and you want to tune it safe. So um, still made 505 kilowatts at the rear wheels, yeah. which is 16 kilowatts at the engine. Um, and uh, only running, I think, 7 or 8 PSI boosts. So, um, and it's got a stage 2 lowering package. True, it has too. So we did the uh, full uh, D-chrome and then added the Z28 wheels. Z28, which is similar to W1, aren't they? Yeah. And the satin black. Yeah. And yeah, the full D chrome. So basically, all that chrome is gone all around the grills, yeah. windowsill. Plastic chrome. Yep, plastic up the badges. Yeah. Even did custom black pipes for them. That when we did the stage seven. And um, yeah, certainly looks good in the white, doesn't it? Yeah. All right, start it up. Let's have a little quick listen to it, eh? This isn't right. Okay, so uh, we uh, got the dyno sheet here, Ryan, haven't we? Yeah. And this really shows everyone the benefits of adding a Whipple to an existing so cam the, package. Yep, so this is just stage seven without the Whipple. Yep. And then you got with the whipple, just yep. see how much that increases. Yeah, so the power levels are good. Like we said before, 95 octane, we, we can't run as much timing. So we would, I think if we went to 98, we'd, this would make four to, uh, 620, 625 kilowatts or probably about 530 at the rear wheels, somewhere around there. Yep. But really, the torque is the key, isn't it? If you look at the torque... Yeah, 840 gone, newton meters. And it was 620. Um, but yeah. you look at where it's making it, and so it's making 750 from pretty much 2200 RPM and it's just very, very linear. So um, yeah, pretty cool to drive now. Yeah.